Hey, I, I've been doing this job for a very long time and today is just as special as the first one and speaking to young people and their parents and their kind of emotion and and the feeling of today is just very very special day and I'm delighted to be able to share it you know with them and with others as well a fantastic day for the school and for all the young people uh, I've done really well for my, uh, well I've just done really well I'm really happy ABB uh, I got A star AAB so over the moon uh, University at Northumbria to do design and industry. <laughs> I've got a BCB, so yeah. Is that what you picked it or is that what you expected? Or? Uh, yeah, it's sort of what I expected, so it's, uh, yeah, I'm really happy with it. So. Uh, I got A star, A star A this year, and then I got an A star in maths last year as well. Is that beyond your expectations? Um, it was a bit. I knew I could do well, but this was um, sort of beyond what I thought I might do. So yeah, it's very good. The majority of our students uh, will progress through into the sixth form. So what we did yesterday is we spent the day working out um, how the students had done and whether they got the grades to go into the courses that they wanted um, to do. And the vast majority of students um, have achieved the grades that they need to progress to the next, the next stage. And that's really a, a huge credit to, to them, their efforts the work of their families over many, many years and the support and dedication of our teachers um, at, at the school. So it's just wonderful to see students progressing to our sixth form at Harriet Graham School. It's been a really good day. Um, these days are always quite emotional. Um, there's so much at stake for the young people. And, and this, is, this is about the school. We're a school, we care how all the children go on. But more than anything, it's about each and every one of the young people here who worked so hard for the Ray Levels. And the great news is that here, again, we've got a fantastic set of results and the vast majority of the children have got into their first choice of university and those that haven't looked very likely they're going to get choices through, through clearing. Uh, going to Imperial College down in London to study mechanical engineering. In September I'm going to the Royal Academy of Music in London. I'm really, really happy. <laughs> I'm so excited. Just support from the teachers, my friends, and just the enjoyable courses, I'd say. Yeah, but also I'm looking forward to the future and what that brings as well. So I came in year seven, so, and they've been really, really good. It's been such a lovely place to be, honestly. So. That fit, feels like a long time ago, but it's been seven really good years. And the doors are always open and everything, it's, it's really lovely, yeah. Um, I think the, um, what makes our school really, really special is how we work in that unique um, relationship between the, the students and their productivity and their dedication that we encourage and all the work we've done with them in terms of retaining information which they have to do for their new GCSE, but also the support that we get from families and then that dedication and that real professionalism from our teachers who are incredibly experienced and passionate about maximising the life chances of our young people. And I think that creates the culture that's very, very unique at that school, which is about excellence for every child. Um, and I think that combination is what makes this a very, very special um, place. And that carries on in the sixth form. We know that overall uh, the students have done really well and we know that particularly because the progress uh, measure that we have is even better than it was last year. So students as well as doing well have actually shown greater progress from their starting point and that's what we'd hoped for as a school, that every student who comes here makes progress from wherever their starting point through to where they finish. There's so many good news stories today from the students who are going off to, to Imperial, uh, to Oxford, uh, to study some amazing courses right up and down the length and breadth of the land and internationally with a student going off to Harvard uh, and student also going off to the College of Music in London. It really is a real diversity in terms of the, the destinations for our young people. Really, really proud of him. He's worked very, very, very hard and that was what he wanted to do. He, want, he always wanted to go to London, to Imperial and it, he kind of had that as his goal and he didn't lose sight of it and he just worked very, very hard. So we're, we're really, really proud of him. Really good, really good. Yeah, um, he's, they've supported him. He's worked really hard, he's worked really hard and he's had great support from the teachers um, every step of the way, haven't you? Um, and really deserves what he's got, I think.
I would really just like to thank um, our students for their hard work, their perseverance and dedication, our families who supported um, the young people and then to the, our teachers who've given dedicated service to the school and really provided excellence for all.